but we're going to turn to a security issue closer to home now, because a migrant has been stabbed in the camp at Calais, this uh, jungle, as it's sometimes known, uh, of people waiting to cross across to the United Kingdom, trying to get on boats. Well, our very own home and security editor, Mark White, has uh, had an exclusive report in the last few days saying that the security situation there was getting worse, to some extent foreboding, uh, warning of this situation. Mark, uh, did you see this coming? Well, certainly we've been told by security sources that the situation in northern France is getting increasingly violent, uh, both migrant on migrant violence and violence from migrants aimed at the French authorities because they don't like the French intervening, trying to puncture their dinghies and stopping these boats from launching in the first place. Now, the latest incident happened at an area uh, called Lune Plage, uh, which is an area of woodland and abandoned rail tracks uh, on the outskirts of Dunkirk. It can house this uh, makeshift camp, more than a thousand people, but it's sporadically raided by the French authorities at the moment without a period where there's probably a couple of hundred migrants there or so. Uh, but emergency services were called to reports of a migrant having been stabbed on the outside of this camp at Lune Plage. When they got there, they found a man in his 30s with multiple stab wounds to his chest. Uh, French fire brigade paramedics uh, tried to work on this man to save his life for around about an hour, but were unable to save his life. He died at the scene. The French police have had no cooperation at all from other migrants. No one has come forward uh, to give them any information. And as yet, no suspects are in custody. But of course, they suspect that this person died at the hands of another migrant. And it follows, as I say, growing levels of violence. Just a fortnight ago, you may remember a boat that crossed the English Channel arriving in Dover Harbour with a migrant on board who had been stabbed. Uh, we got exclusive footage of the time of emergency services who were uh, at Dover Harbour awaiting the arrival of that small boat. Now, this migrant, it turns out, had been stabbed by a criminal people smuggler on a beach near Cali uh, because he was attempting to get onto a small boat without paying. And this is an increasing phenomenon, especially among African migrants who don't have the money to pay the people smugglers. Instead, they try to rush the boats on the beach as they're launching and try just to push their way on board. When they come up against the people smugglers, then that often ends very violently. And then again, just recently, another incident very worrying uh, in Boulogne, further down the coast, where some 350 migrants were attempting to launch four small boats. The French police tried to intervene. They got pelted with sticks and stones, other missiles. Uh, the migrants even poured petrol on the beach uh, to try to set that alight to keep the French police away from puncturing those boats and a number of French officers were injured in this. So increasing levels of violence, uh, a sign of the, the desperation, but a sign too, I think, Tom, of just how lucrative this trade is, how valuable it is to the criminal gangs, and they will fight for their turf and they will fight against those who try to get on board these boats and get a free ride to the UK.